Hey, raindrops. Hey, raindrops. Hey, raindrops. Okay. This is part two. Um, my video um, disconnected uh, yesterday. So, this is the part two when I pull on your um, spiritual team that comes through with more clarity and confirmations. Okay. From the last read. All right. Um, I'm using my deck on this portion and I'm gonna pull letters as well, okay? Yeah, um, so let's hop on in. This is part two, you guys, remember that, okay? The energy was, um, you know, uh, break the, Break that generational curse entity, okay, by forgiving those who have um, probably mishandled you, okay, and, and forgive others that may have put you in situations of unfair treatment here, okay, that you held on to, okay, as, um, as a child here, all right? So let's step in. Ooh, see, they coming out. They're coming out already. I'm gonna pull a few more. Fiji water is here. Um, you need to do a spiritual detox is what I'm getting with that. Okay, or someone may be going to Fiji. All right, as well. Or stay in the boundaries of Fiji. Okay. A few more spirits. Mm. Yeah, card on the bottom of the deck. You have healed. Okay, it was not easy. This is what um, came out in the reading. It was not easy. It was not easy on both ends of the stick. Okay, especially if you're um, traumatized or certain things that happened in your childhood. It's, it's, it's not easy to process um, your innocence being you know, taint it, all right, if you will, okay? Yeah, a lot of hidden secrets, and I, I call that. These were some of the secrets. The secret was, um, it, it's a long line of, uh, you know, demonic entities that been roaming in the family dynamic, okay? Wanted more attention than your children here. Yeah, so if you were tied to such... Um, entities you know um in relationship wise this person probably wanted more attention than than your children because they tapped out you have to remember they tapped out when they were young okay they had the abandonment issue so they they um didn't know how to to process the nurturing and, and care and love that you gave off to your children because to them um you know, their love language should be abuse, verbal abuse, mental abuse, you know, or whatever that they tapped out in, whatever was done to them, okay? Um, a lot of narcs uh, have this, you know, mental imbalance um, and mental belief system when they come in and want more attention than your children because like I said, in their past, they were abandoned. They didn't get the attention or the proper attention that was needed for their growth, okay? Or, like I said, um, some tragic things happened, okay, in their childhood. They did not process it. Like I said, they checked out, okay? That is called um, arrested development. So, some of these people, you know, they got arrested when the, when the you know, when the... um mishandling of them uh, occurred to them, okay? It says, shh, be quiet. Those are, this This is you that is going into your nerf node here, okay? Spirit wants you to be quiet. Get with, with self here, okay? Get with spirit here. You have to be quiet to hear, okay? And, and some of these people don't want you speaking, okay? 
as well. They don't want you speaking your truth. They want you to be quiet on uh, such energies that hold titles. They want you to be quiet. They don't want you to speak your truth, okay? Um, they kind of want to remain in the energy, um, in the background of the um, never knowing, okay? Some want to take shit that was done to you to their graves here, all right? Um, I call it Fiji water. Yeah, you need to do a spiritual detox here. And that's another reason you need to get still so you can hear from spirit here, okay? Yeah, lazy day. Okay, so some of you, your your energies will be drained when you go on this spiritual awakening here. You will be drained because you're purging off um, certain things. You're healing. Okay, so um, you're going to the core of yourself. Okay, and these things have to layer off like an onion here to get to the core. Okay, you know an onion has a core, but it has many different layers. And these layers, okay, that you're purging off and, and healing, um, you will become you know, kind of kind of physically drained, spiritually drained, okay, as you're purging though, but keep going. It's going to feel like you're depleted in energies here, okay? And this is to restore your balance. This is to restore um, yourself unto the right path you're supposed to be in. This is to restore your spiritual balance. This is to restore your mental balance and clarities here, all right? Yeah, because some of you are sleeping with the enemy. That's that person that did not want you to show love to your children, but wanted all the attention on them, okay? That's a manipulation tactic as well, okay? So be careful of that. Keep your eyes out for that. A person that is grown and wants attention all on them, okay, versus you giving it to your kids, that's a red flag, okay? So pay attention to that. Keep your eyes open, all right? This is some type of mental imbalance here. Or this is a, a red flag to this person have some healing to do, all right, as well. Okay, solar, okay? Um, dealing with some of this, your your immune system was thrown off as well. Dealing with such a person, okay, and operating in these energies. Your immune um, was thrown off your chakra, your, your solar chakra. You couldn't create anything. I mean, you couldn't even, you didn't have the energy to create anything. Okay. You were depleted in all aspects of your spiritual being. Okay. So you have to close the chapters, close the chapters, forgive, close the chapters. Okay. Yeah. A lot of victim shaming was going on with you. That that's that shut the hell up. Okay. That's that shut the hell up um, that was done to you as a child when you told of, you know, the improper handlement of you to um, family and friends here, okay? And, 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 and lovers here as well, because some will take uh, what was done to you or if you have shared such a thing, they will victim shame you with it, all right? Because they don't want to heal, yeah. They they were victim shame shame you. They were gaslight and the shit become one sided. Okay, they never wanted to hear your side anyway. So it's best just to close the chapter, forgive for your spiritual purpose and growth, and move the fuck on. All right, it's not easy. No, it's not. Okay, but it is something for you to do to to get out of this imbalance in in this uh, demonic ass energy and attachments that are attaching to some of you guys, okay? Um, some of you uh, moon with, with the moon cycles here, um, you know, your menstrual, you may moon with the moon cycles here, okay? Or you are um, a moon baby or um, you're very in tune with the moon, okay? Yeah, some of these people lack awareness of self. And this was um, possibly how you started feeling in such connections again with such people. You you started not even believing that you were in reality here, okay? It was such illusionments and delusionments, okay? Lack of awareness, that that's a mental manipulation on your mind, on your psyche here from such people, okay? Yeah, Little Red Riding Hood, okay? Little Red Riding Hood, you were tricked and trapped here, 
okay, with such people. Again, someone name may be Leon, someone name may be Leandra, and also a Andre is here, okay. You gotta get back to this, okay, Trinity. Triple threes you may be seeing, okay? That may be a sign for you that this message is confirmation as well. You may be seeing triple threes here. Mind, body, and spirit. This is what the path you need to be on, okay? So you can start aligning and be one with source here. Because you... Look, this say a heart cough and I got a cough, okay? They wanted to fuck with your heart chakras here because their heart chakras are closed, okay? So... This energy was designed when your heart chakras close. Some things, uh, <coughs> look at this shit. The alignment be real. Your heart chakras, they wanted to close off your heart chakras. They did not want you to uh, love yourself here. They wanted you to stay in such energy, okay, to operate low. That way um, you will be distorted um in your relationships okay you will have distorted love views even with yourself here okay and this th this is also a manipulation tactic used by narcissism okay boots okay it's time for you to stand up stand on all toes okay and lace up your boots here okay march okay um someone's birthday may be in march or march may um resonate with you here Okay, willpower. Yeah. It's time for you to lace up your boots. Call back your power. Okay? Stand in your own willpower here. All right? Because if you give your power away, it's over. Okay? You will, be, you, will succumb, you will be overran and succumb to negative demonic energies. Okay? And that's also a part of these that are operating in narcissism or narcissistic traits here okay willpower they don't have the willpower so they try to snatch yours okay they don't have the willpower to heal so they don't want you to heal they don't have the willpower to create so they want to steal from you and take your creation they don't have the willpower to get into self okay so they try to keep you away from yourself all right Five, 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 rapid um, changes ahead, okay? Only if you start walking towards your north node here. It'll be fast action, okay? And rapid changes instantly, okay? Starve them out. This is what I'm saying, okay? Starve them out. Starve that energy out. Cut it off at the head, all right? That entity, break the generational curse for your family here, okay? Um, someone wants you to lay on their chest here, okay? Someone is coming in that you can lay all your burdens down, okay? Or this may have been um, also a connection that you was in when you were operating toxic or operating out of um, this person's toxicity, okay? Their energies, they kind of... Uh, I'm getting they kind of kind of put you at bay in when you laid on their chest, okay? It is a um that tactic is a uh like a like a ooh, how can I say it? Like a controlling mechanism, okay? It's like when they do something or this person they put you in this this uh energy here to operate in or, or or cause some type of um scene okay that was improper here their thing of regaining control was having you lay on their chest here okay it's a spirit transfer here okay as well okay like i said love is not boxed in it's in many ways love come in many ways Love come in many forms here, okay? But you have to process what is proper love and what is love that is, is not proper here, okay? And that is the energy or entity that overran some of your family dynamics here back in the day, okay? You did not need an apology. 
all right? For some of you, you did not want an apology. You did not need the apology. You just wanted to heal. You wanted to find better. You wanted better for yourself than operating low. Um, you, you was tired of feeling depleted here, okay? You started um, finding your self-worth again and, and, and coming back to self-awareness that oh this inner it's the energy it's the company i keep okay it's the it's the things that i do um drinking alcohol whatever and and i don't knock none of that okay um just do it responsibly here okay but if you know it's something that pulls you down and you find yourself in situations you might want to look into that okay um drinking was a vice that was attached to me okay an entity that was attached to me um, and I had to go, you know, during my healing process, I had to go in deep within and say, no, this drinking is the trigger. This drinking is the spirit that's attached. This drinking is the spirit that been attached to me when such and such happened to me as a child. I went to drinking to numb shit. Okay. Not to feel shit. Okay. To, to feel like I belong, okay, um, to feel just the ounce of normalcy, okay, but, uh, I am a recovered, um, alcoholic, I, hey, I can admit my shit, I stand ten toes in it, all right, um, uh, also, you know, people, you, like I said, that victim shaming, people, instead of people asking what's really going on behind the scenes, um, of my alcohol intake, okay? Um, I got victim shame for it. But see, the thing with that is, I can stand 10 toes in it and talk about it. Yeah, it was a trigger for me, but I was numbing also from having to fight such a fucking entity, okay? I was sleeping with the real live motherfucking demon. And it's cool, lessons learned, all right? Lessons learned. They were pulling love from me, okay? that they see I did not have in myself yet because I was looking for love outside of me. So it was easy for this attachment, this entity, this demon to come in and infiltrate. You get it? Okay, and like I said, I take accountability, lesson learned, oh well, okay? Now that the lessons is learned for me, okay? I thank you for that because it pushed me here. It pushed me into my power. It pushed me to create businesses. It pushed me to stand on my motherfucking own. And my shit is solid, okay? It pushed me to always follow my first motherfucking mind. It pushed me into my spiritual gifts to heighten, okay? It pushed me to operate in that. My spiritual gifts is my abundance, right? Okay? They demoted their legacy and bloodline. Yeah, those, that was that's those demon connections you were in, okay? These are the ones that didn't want to heal. These are the ones that dismissed you for healing. These are the ones that went behind your back and slandered you, okay? Instead of um, offering advice that you could use, okay? They were talking about your story versus helping your story, all right? So that's why... You were told to close the chapter, okay? And stay moving ahead. I just said that. Stay moving ahead. Once you close the chapter, stay moving ahead. And on this, on the top of my deck is road opener. Stay moving ahead. Your roads are going to be open, all right? As you heal, all right? Stay on the road of healingness and watch the rewards, okay? When you detach from such things, watch how... Everything that belongs to you, everything that was for you by spirit is going to find you, all right? And it's going to function, it's going to operate, okay? It's going to leave legacies, okay? It's going to heal, it's going to heal you and your children uh, dynamic, okay? It's going to open up so much more positive shit you gonna be like, damn, I wish I could have been at this motherfucker sooner, right? All while standing by yourself with your spiritual team and your ancestors. Finding yourself, basically, is what I'm saying. Mastering 
yourself. All right. I'm going to pull the letters now. Okay, so I'm going to need you to listen to part one. All right. Um, oh, I shouldn't have did that because I had the vowels already out. Hold on, guys. But I'm going to need you to go back and listen to part one. All right. Um, and this will tie into, um, this will tie onto this one that I'm on now, speaking to you from now. Okay. This is also a, a part where your ancestors, your loved ones come in and, and give you more clarity. They may spell their names. Okay. Or names that resonates with you or anything that is concerning of you. All right. I'm just going to pull a few. How's your Venus day going, guys? Your love, all right? My baby girl walked in. <laughs> okay, she she's, uh, you know, at the age she's experiencing, you know, living outside the home, but she's never far from me. She's never going to stay far from me, okay? Um, she's, she's on her own path here, all right? All I do is guide her, guide her with wisdom, okay? Guide her with doing things right, no no matter among who she is, okay? Or who she's among, all right? When she's not in the eyesight, close eyesight of me, okay? This home is her solitude. This home is her peace. She know when she comes to here, she can be herself. She can free herself. She can talk to me about anything. Me and my daughter is best friends here. All right. People don't like that though. <laughs> but I get it. Yeah. That one, baby, you won't defer her from me. I don't give a damn what you do that one there that that first one that guinea pig because you didn't know about mother they teach you baby they teach you you gonna humble your motherfucking self yeah so we have a great relationship awesome okay awesome and i respect it and i respect her individuality as well okay a few more and well this enough yeah that popped out mm -hmm. oh excuse me a spiritual birth confirmation all right so let's let's tap into these letters let's see what your people all right is coming in and have for you okay Uh, BB is here. Someone's nickname. Um, you may like that uh, brand. I used to love wearing BB. I, I love that brand. <clears throat> I have a CC on the board as well. Um, someone may be drinking wine or want some wine for later. A nice nightcap. C O R K is here. Okay. Ooh. I have Ace, okay? Ace of Swords. This is the truth. The reading was the truth. Those cards were the truth. That's my confirmation for me as well. Ooh. Okay, I have a Corey here. C-O-R-E-Y. Alright. C-O-R-E-Y is here. Um, someone needs to lay off pork. P-O-R-K is here as well. Okay, you need to lay off of that is what I'm getting. Um, I have fire, F-I-R-E, fire and desire. Someone is desiring you at this moment, okay? Someone desires also um, to cop, please, is what I'm saying. Someone is desiring to come in your energy and apologize. Um, I don't know if this apology is genuine here, okay? Um, you have to use your spiritual discernment, okay? 
and as again you can accept the apology for what it's worth and, and keep it moving if you feel it's disingenuous um genuine okay yeah someone wanted you broke down in spirit b-r-o-k-e is here they wanted you broke down in spirit or your spirit was broken from being such in a connection with a narc here okay i have a brock as well b r o c k is here all right um they never cared for you c a r e is here okay f o r s is here and y o u is here they never cared for you all right um these people that was um very tumultuous in your life or in energy okay i have uh a casey okay casey um jodeci k c i is here casey from the jodeci you might like the jodeci or you're listening to jodeci music okay um i have Let's see. I have joy, J-O-Y, your joy is coming back. Um, you may be getting company and it may be your son getting out of school. S-O-N, excuse me for a second. Yeah, uh, your son may be at the age where they smelling their self, okay? They want to size you up, all right? And get knocked the hell down, okay? But they're teens, okay? So they at the age of smelling yourself. My son is. He's at that age, all right? A-G-E is here, as I said it. S-O-N is here again, okay? Um, someone uh, loves the winter months. S-N-O-W is here, okay? Love the winter. Mm -hmm. I have uh, I have a uh, B B E E. Okay, you may be seeing a lot of bees at this time, or the bees are. Uh, it's time for them to go ahead and find their last cop and um, flower. I'm saying, and um do what they do and they're going to take it on in okay at this time at this uh change of weather here okay um i have war okay these people call it spiritual war here okay spiritual war or there went um inflicted in the mind is really a spiritual war they're having um with their mind the narcissistic people that you endure okay they're having a mental warfare here as well w-a-r-f-a-r -A -A is here warfare all right um yeah uh i have a fay here F-A-E, someone believes in phase or are seeing phase. F-A-E-S is here, okay? I also have a, a name that can be fade. F-A-Y is, I mean, F-A-Y is here as well, okay? This may be a name that resonates with you or a nickname um, that is here, okay? I have... Cake, C-A-K-E is here, okay? They thought this was a piece of cake, okay? Um, that they had it in the bag, okay? They thought this was a piece of cake to come against you here. Or this entity that been in the family dynamic here, okay? 
when your generation came along, okay, um, this entity felt like it was it was going to be a piece of cake to devour you, okay, or to get you to stay operating as such, okay. Confirmation. <laughs> um. Yeah, someone thought you were crazy to heal. C R A Z Y, or this was some of the things that were said about you through your childhood here that you were crazy. Okay, you may have had mental issues, you had ADHD, and but that was all a manipulation um, tactic to you not speaking your truth here. So, whatever they can put on you to believe for yourself, the better. All right, like I said this entity and the entity that it was work uh, the people that this entity was working in thought it would be a piece of cake okay they are surprised here okay for some of these people they are surprised at your strength here s u r p r i s e is here they were very surprised they are very surprised as well a r e is here is surprised is is here they are surprised at your strength and they are surprised at you coming up out of this you're pulling yourself up here uh-huh like i said they thought this entity that was operating in such um people around you thought it was a uh, a cakewalk okay it's it was a piece of cake for your for your spirit to be demolished okay with this entity all right eight four eight on the clock um cop is here okay um there maybe um one of the the connections that you got away from okay the toxic connection um they're still in your energy they're still pulling on your energy meaning they're coming by unannounced and riding by um, unannounced and, and, sh and, and stupid shit like that you may have to call the cops okay so be careful all right like i said they are on war time here demon time if you will okay because these are the people that can't let go let you go let your energy go okay because they were so used to operating out of your spirit okay out of your spirit which was your true nature, you just snatched your power back here. Now they need to feed, all right? P-O-W-E-R is here, okay? So yeah, um, and you know, nar narcs don't let go easy. N-A-R-C is here, S. Narcs don't let go easy. They don't, they, 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 they view you as property for one, okay? They view you as an investment for two. All right, they're not going to let you go. You can say, uh, well, I think um, it's me, okay? It's me that don't have it together. It's me that's not ready for the relationship. You're not doing anything. It's me. I want to get myself together. They hear you? Oh, but baby, them grips, you you, you can't get out of their grips unless they say so, okay? And, and it would never be, I'm telling you, it will never be. They, they're going to stay attached to you or try to stay around you, anything with you, if not take you out of here. Because for one, they don't want nobody else to embody what they could not do. They don't want to be seen as the weakest link in your life. They don't want to be seen as a past memory here, okay? They don't want to be seen as that. They will cause your life a living fucking hell. W-R-E-C-K. That's what narcs energy do. They cause your life a wreck here. Wreck. And some of you, shit, I know you felt like you was in a wreck. Shit. Because shit, I was. Hell. Uh-huh. I'm still getting, you know, uh, ride-bys and, and shit like that. Uh, this person think I doesn't I do not see them okay I mean whatever um, you possibly were married to this person R I N G is here because I as me speaking on my 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 uh narc which was my ex-husband okay so yeah 
Yeah, they got their eye on you still. E-Y-E is here. Eyes. It's a lot of eyes on you as well. Okay? It's not just your your ex-husband here, Your this narc energy here. It's a lot of people. Eyes are on you at this moment because you were supposed to break and not get the fuck up or put yourself back together here. Okay? You are not supposed to do that. All right? Um... But you, you're walking into a clean slate, okay? W-I-P-E is here. You're walking on a whole new clean slate by choosing yourself here, all right? You said the hell with anything. Let them have it. Let people think what they will. Let the gossip continue. You know what you are. You know what you're not doing. You know what you are doing, okay? Let that gossip shit go, okay? The shit be fucked up, though. Don't get me wrong, because... Sometimes you want to bust a bitch in a motherfucking mouth, but as you mature and get on your spiritual growth, you don't have time for that shit, okay? That's a tactic too, all right? That's a tactic too. You don't have time, time for that. Don't stunt yourself or find yourself in jail, okay? Because these motherfuckers, people, emotions are still fucked up, okay? Tad, don't have no emotions, emotionless motherfucking beings out here okay you have to understand you're dealing with spirits here all right you can see the body car all day you can see the frame of a spirit all day but these motherfuckers be really empty vessels here all right energy vampires here okay so yeah and, and, and right now at, at just the world timeline it, it's time out for that um you young girls are getting wiped out by the day by unbalanced young men at 16 17 20 years old y'all are getting wiped out every day that's a problem that's a pro that's the entity and all that was was this blue shine i mean chris shine and blue face shit that they usher in front of y'all and wanted y'all to mimic and and operate in. That's an entity. So all the energy y'all gave to this shit, y'all were really inviting it into your own mental, into your own homes, into your own lives, okay? Like I said, it is spiritual first, all right? Um, yeah. So... <laughs> Mm. But anyway, um, yeah, I have um, Bo as well, B-O-W. Someone wants to offer you a gift here, okay? Or someone, confirmation, someone is bringing a gift in, okay? Um, I don't really feel this is coming from a place of again genuineness this is that ex narc that wants to come back in your energy they're fin to come and bear gifts here okay um a knight in shiny armor type of dynamic okay but this is the person that uh wanted you low to the motherfucking ground told your whole foundation up okay but see this is what they like i said this is another one that did not expect you to move on accordingly okay narcs create situations narcs will start a fight with you to go fuck with another motherfucker okay you have to understand that too they will start a fight with you to go fuck with another supply all right because you're not acting you're not acting right for for them to feed on at the time okay um or i mean shit it's just you were a source of supply for some Okay? And, and narcs is not just lovers. It's, it's fam too. Okay? Yeah, so... Um, but you won the battle by walking and um, going on your he healing journey. W-O-N is here. Okay? You won the battle. Alright? That's why you get, you're you getting this clean slate here. Okay? New beginnings is here. All right, you're walking into your new beginning here. Um, 
someone is a live wire, okay? Or they thought you were a, a they wanted to be the flame for you to act out, you know, in public. Yeah, public is here. They wanted to get you in some type of situation to act out in public, unhinged and shit. That, th this is what these people do. Or they kept you in situations, if it's family, to have you unhinged by your vices, okay? Yeah. They wanted to rob you, W-O-B is here. They wanted to rob you of your pureness, of your energy here. Wow. Of your character is what I'm getting with that. With the want to um, have you looking unhinged in public. They wanted to rob you of your character here. Okay. Um, mm. Yeah, but some of these people that did this uh, will be going behind bars. Okay. Time is up here. B-A-R-S is here. Some of these people are getting locked up. Um, so, yeah, as possible FBI as well. Um, this may have to do with fraud. Fraud attempts using your name here. Okay. Yeah, scam likely. Scams. I got a scam likely coming in, y'all. Yeah, someone is, uh, will be getting locked up, okay, for using your name, okay? There's a, fest, uh, unbeknownst to you right now, there's a federal investigation going on because your name came up in several, uh, scams and frauds that, uh, was using your social. SOC is here. SEC is here as well. Social security number, all right? Yeah. Wow. You will get word of this though, okay? You will get word of this. And whoever, yeah, they wronged you, W-R-O-N-G. Yeah, they wronged you behind your back here, B-A-C-K is here. They wronged you behind your back here. Whoa. There is a pending case, C-A-S-E is here. Okay, come through, spirit. Okay, you getting this out for your love bugs. Mm. Yeah, so you will get word of this. Whoa. Um. Yeah, robbery is here as well. R-O-B-B-E-R-Y. Yeah. Mm-mm. J-O-I-N, mm -mm -mm. yeah. They're gonna be joining you into the uh joining you onto this information that uh the FBI will be contacting you. Okay. They're going to want to join you into a meeting to talk about uh this uh, fraud and scam and all this shit that's going on behind this case here. Okay, they're gonna want you to join them in a uh meeting here yeah mm. possibly friday this news will be coming in n-e-w-s is here friday f-r-i possibly friday the news is will be coming in or you will hear of this okay so y'all can um set up the meeting here Wow. Yeah, someone's taking their ass behind bars. Ooh, we. Mm. They will not receive any grace. That means they're going to be punished to the full extent, or your spiritual team is telling you to punish them to the full extent. There will be no grace handed out, says your ancestors here. G-R-A-C-E is here. That may be a name that resonates with you, but on what I'm speaking on at this second is, there will be no grace handed out, 
pursue they asses to the full intent here. Yeah. Wow. Um, this news may make a uh, public hair headlines here. Um, PB public broadcasting systems here. Okay, this might make the news. Yeah, this might make the news here. Or the World Wide Web, W-E-B is here. Oh, we. Um, if you have a, a social network here, S-O-C, okay? N-E-T is here. If you have a social network or a platform here, um, you have, you're going to have many um, coming fans, okay? This will be your soul tribe. S-O-U-L. This will be your soul tribe coming in. T-R-I-B-E. Yeah, this will be your soul tribe. They are fans of what you do or what you do on your, your platform, okay? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and um, tap out. Okay. If there's not anything else. Someone may be going to Wingstop. W-I-N-G is here. Okay. Or like Wingstop Wings. Um. Yeah. You like them fried hard. F-R-Y is here. <laughs> you like extra lemon pepper P-E-P-P-E-R is here Okay um, uh, Someone is Wants to get cozy They want to lay up under you Okay C-O-Z-Y is here Someone wants to just relax and get cozy, okay? And when you're going through your healing journey, when you have those lazy days, cozy up with a book, okay? Cozy up with something that can help you um, keep your mind grounded, all right? A book or painting, coloring is good. Um, some of the things like, take your baths, okay? Stay taking your spiritual baths because you're gonna need that, okay? Um, as you go through the process confirmation so stay taking your spiritual baths okay you can just get epsom salt for that if you don't have all the perks and, and for the fancier baths okay um for for the ones that are new on their journey okay sea salt as well sea is here all right so yeah but someone wants to cozy up with you okay they want to lay under you be under you here okay So use your discernment on whoever this person may be. All right. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to need you to red ball this to this point, the letters at the beginning, and, and um, sit with it, write them down, because it may be something else that sticks out that your personal spiritual team wants to give to you in a personal space, okay? S-P-A-C-E is here, yeah. So, um, other messages that may come out when you red ball it back to me putting the letters down, okay? Um, you will, uh, they will come through to you on a more personal setting what may sticks out to you or what they want you to see all right okay so g n p o c y k w b b r f c z i e 
another I S A E O U J L T. All right. All right, love bugs. Hope this helped. Stay on your journeys. Keep going.